Are you ready, Vishwa? Perfect. Hey guys, today we're gonna play. Vishwa, you you're live. Be nice. Hello. Today we're gonna play. Sure. Um. Hey guys, today we're gonna play on um, educational.com. So we've played um educational.com like tons of times. So we're gonna play again. And are you guys ready for it to play educational.com today? I hope you will come. Let's play. Where? Okay, which one? That? I'm done. Reading and spelling? Vocabulary. Ooh. Vocabulary. Let's go to vocabulary. 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 There we go. Oh, yeah. Now it's loading. Word detectives use sentence clues to help figure out what new words mean. He shivers outside in the cold snow. Find the definition for the word shivers, makes, smiles, shakes, shakes. Shakes at the perfect because it's He noticed that something had been moved around in his room. Find the definition for the word noticed. Noticed? Observe. <laughs> I knew that. She nibbles on the cookie. What is the definition for the word? Hmm. Yep. You are a master. You are a master. Huh. You should. 30 minutes. Yep. Do it. Okay. Okay. Now let's do. What's this? Happy and sad kiss. Oh, what's. Now what's Synonyms happening? are words that have almost the same meaning. Let's help Floyd and Bertie learn new ways to say the same thing. Put synonyms for happy. Good. Put synonyms for sad. Here. Hit the button. I'm already starting. Let's go. Samba. Joy. Dolly. And, um. I think the, these all go gloomy. Nah. Devastress. They just pointed to that. Oh my gosh. Tearful. Yeah, that definitely goes there. The real. I think upset definitely go here. Is this right? Oops, that's not right. Oh. Thrilled. Oops, oh. that's not right. It just tells the answers. Synonyms are words that have almost the same meaning. Let's help Floyd and Bertie Watch. learn new ways to say the same thing. Put synonyms for walked here. Put oh. synonyms for looked Correct. here. Hit the done button when you're finished. Correct is here. Chuffed. Chuffed. Wait, is it chuffed? Chuffed. And that maybe what is that? Yeah, I know that. Oh, what's that? Um, synonyms are words that have almost the same meaning. Put synonyms for walked here. Put synonyms for looked here. Hit the done button when you're finished. Roll. Hi, hiked. Wait. Wait. Oops, that's not right. <laughs> Oops, that's not right. Mm. Oops, that's not right. That's correct. Oops, that's not right. Okay, that's good. Oops, that's not right. Yep. Oops, oh. that's not right. Oh, I now. Now, this one. Oops, that's not right. Oops, that's not oh, right. Oh, I haven't got that right. This, this one goes there. Oops, that's not right. Yep, all correct. And then... Oops, that's not right. Yep, we just seen. 
Oops, that's not right. We're done. Your brain, Your brain is just, just warming, warming, up. warming up. Try again. What done? What is it? Yay! Twenty and fifty. I get. Um, I think it's seven. We. Wait. Okay. Do not. Let's so listen to the song. <laughs> when one word is joined with another, they team up to become a contraction. This is Action Contraction. Let us strike. Let's. Do not. Don't. That is. That's. We are. We're. Okay, and somebody yes. look at the chat. How much? Ten. For I we are ten. Okay, next, and we're going to the map, and we're Phonics. going to oh, going to home. Any shopping? Um. Tools? I got oh, both of them. You're a paint? There's paint. Then painting? Loading paint. Just load all of them? Yep. Now, now, I have all the materials. Let me show you how this one works. It makes music. Such good music. Oh, isn't that cool music? And does this look good? Like, throw it. Oh my gosh. And the last thing, where is that one? Should we do one that says V Kids Play? Should we? Should we do one that says V Kids Play? Let's do it. First we have to go, which one? Let's do it in this one. My favorite color? Which, what color? I'll do rainbow. V Kids. No, no, racer, racer, racer. With the racer. Where did I keep my eraser? Keep my eraser somewhere. On there. I think it's that. There we go. I find this painting. This is actually just paint of white. Yay, we cleaned it all. And now let's wait. V kids play. But I'm not doing any color, I'm doing this. V K I D S Wait, maybe that needs a bit bit of a S. <laughs> We can play. No sprays. We need my favorite color. Let's do other colors. We're gonna. We're not gonna use just use red, yellow. I mean, because red was used to be my favorite color, but then I got changed from it because I got a yellow shirt. Now. 
<laughs> and let's do a little arrow saying. <laughs> like it? Now let's go to home. Should we add any stickers? Sport. Sport. Get more stickers. 300 for my favorite tennis ball. I love tennis. That's why. I love tennis. That's why. Now, what shall I do? Shall I go here? All the badges we won. Alright. Award. That gave me four. What's this? Why maybe there you go. We should close that. You can see a mat. Finished everything. Should geometry. Let's go to geometry. The drill finishes me. Song. Oh yeah, we did the song. Subtraction. Oh. Addition, subtraction. We did that. Measurement and data. Measurement and data. Time. Time. Mm. Money. Money? Let's do money. Never showed you the money once. I want to show you money. How it is. Chief, anyone who has met Rolly could tell you that he has more than a little bit of a sweet tooth. Every time Rolly went to town, he passed by the most wonderful bakery. In the window, the baker displayed the biggest, most beautiful cookie Rolly had ever seen. Okay. I really want you to... I hope you... Okay, this is the story. I hope you listen to it. Sometimes, Rolly would just stop in his tracks and admire the cookie, hardly noticing the time pass. Next to the cookie was a sign that said how much it cost. $13.77. It was an expensive cookie, but Rolly had a plan. He knew that he could find a way to earn enough money to pay for it, and it would finally be his. Rolly rolled down the street to Floyd's house and knocked on the door. Floyd opened it, looking in a tizzy. Not now, Rolly, Floyd said out of breath. I have to iron all these tablecloths before the banquet tonight. I'd give ten dollars to have a break from all this ironing. Ten dollars, you say? That happens to be exactly how much I charge for my ironing service. Allow me. Rolly purred. Rolly rolled back and forth across the tablecloths so fast that he was just an orange blur. In no time at all, the tablecloths were flat and their wrinkles gone. Thanks, Rolly, Lloyd said, a little dizzy just from watching. He handed Rolly a $10 bill. Next door in Bertie's treehouse, Bertie was yawning next to a big pile of dishes. Oh, hello, Rolly, she sighed. I've just finished brunch with all of my family, and I'm too tired to do all these dishes. Even if it cost me a whole three dollars, I'd pay someone to take care of them so I could rest. I happen to know someone perfect for the job, Rolly declared. Put your feet up and let me do the rest. Rolly spun and scrubbed in a flurry of soap suds, finishing the dishes before Bertie could even fluff her pillow. You're a lifesaver, Rolly, Bertie said as she handed Rolly three one dollar bills. The cookie is thirteen dollars and seventy seven cents, and I have thirteen dollars so far. I'm so close, Rolly said. Close by, Penelope and Cuzcuz were huffing and 
puffing as they tried to push a sofa across the street. It's no use, Penelope said. You don't even have hands, cuz cuz. Then Penelope spotted Rolly. Rolly, if you help us move this sofa, you can have all the coins that have fallen in between the cushions. You have yourself a deal, Rolly said. Rolly went to the top of the hill and tumbled down, gaining speed until he rammed it to the side of the sofa, pushing it across the street and into Cuz Cuz's living room. Under the cushions, Rolly found two quarters, two dimes, and one nickel, and one penny. Seventy-six cents! Now I have thirteen dollars and seventy-six cents all together, he hooted. Wait, isn't this silly? First, is it, first he had um, thirteen dollars and now he has one dollar extra. Okay, let's, let's move on and just see what happens next. The sun was setting. The bakery was about to close and Rolly still didn't have enough for the extraordinary cookie. He made his way back home, but stopped by the bakery to see the cookie one more time. What are you up to, Rolly? said Muggo, who was passing by. Then Muggo looked up and saw the cookie. Wow, that's the most beautiful cookie I have ever seen. And I'm just one penny short, Rolly said, downcast. Just a penny? Well, here, take this one. Thank you, thank you, Muggo, Rolly cheered, and he dashed inside. He laid out all the money he had earned on the counter. I would like that cookie in the window, please. Knowing that he had worked hard to earn it made having the cookie feel even more special. But Rolly felt the greatest joy when he got to share it with all of his wonderful friends. Done. Okay, we're done. In this cool. book. Now we're going to next next step. These coins are out of order. Can you help put the coins in order from highest value to lowest mm -hmm. value? I think this is good here. That goes there. Is that it? That had to go somewhere. Is that the lowest? Or maybe that's a dollar. I think it's. Oh my! I'm tell. Where did it say it? Is there any dolls that say it? I must be oldest. That's super old. Not that good there, and this maybe goes there. Now what do we just push through? Should, should we move on? Are you sure you want to leave this challenge? No, because I don't know where the done button. I know this one. Floyd, Rolly, Bertie, and Cuz Cuz are fishing for coins in the couch. Find the coin that answers each question. Which coin is worth 25 cents? Nickel. Nickel. Dime. Penny. Quarter. Quarter. Which coin is worth the least? Nickel. Dime. Dime. D nickel. Nickel. Penny. Penny. Which coin is worth 10 cents? Nickel. Dime. Nickel. Nickel. Dime. Oh Dime. Which coin is worth 1 cent? Nickel. Penny. Quarter. Nickel. Nickel. Penny. Penny. Now I get it which one's the highest and lowest. 
Your brain is just warming up. Try again. This is just, just, we know, we know, we know. Oh, wait, next. Let's do this one now. Now I know which one. These coins are out of order. Can you help? Put the coins in there. order That's from highest value to lowest value. Wait, what was the order again? Which was five ten? Um, I think that one. What? Put the coins in order from highest value to lowest value. I'm so confused. I such do piggy banks. Are you sure you want to leave this challenge? Uh, no, How no. much money is in the piggy bank? Count up the total of the different coins. Three cents? Up to three plus five equals eight. Eight plus ten equals eighteen. Ten plus twenty equals um twenty-eight. So it adds twenty-five more. So we add two more to it. Two ten twenty more. So Let's add 20 more. 48. Now, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53. How much money is in the piggy bank? Add the rest, 53. ka -ching. Let's put more money in the piggy bank. Ready? Add 46 cents using the coin shown. Hit 46. When you're finished. Let's do it. 46. Let's put this. That equals 40. No. Oh my gosh. Forty cents in there. Ten twenty thirty forty. Wait, what was that? Add forty six. Since using the coin show, hit the done button when you're finished. Oops, that's not right. Add 46 cents using the coin shown. What? How can that be wrong? <coughs> now let's see. 25? Let's put that really neat. After 25, what is it? Hmm. 25 cents plus um, 10, 10 equals 25 cents plus 10 equals 35. Now it's 45. And then... This one, done. That's right. How much money is in the piggy bank? Count up the total of the different coins. I'm gonna guess. This one? Oops, that's not right. Count up the total of the different coins. It can't be 22 cents. Nine, nine. Cool, counting. <laughs> that's one full piggy bank. <laughs> That's not even 99. That can't be 99. You're getting there. Yeah. Learn on. Yeah, but I've been doing this for ever ages. Oh, I always struggle that one. How much money is shown? How much money is shown? 25? Oh my. 5? Then 30 with that 25. 30. Then 35. Then 45. 55. That's right. Penelope has 55 cents. She spends 24 cents at the store. Put the coins in the cash register here. Hit the done button when you're finished. 10, 20, and then he spent 24. 1, 2, right. that's 1, that's 2, that's 3, and that's 4. That's right. How much money does she have left? Um, 31. That's right. Happy shopping, Penelope. Mm -hmm.
You are a master. Yep, I'm totally a master. Effort. Ten coins. Give me like hundreds of coins. Are you sure you want to leave this challenge? Time. Ah, <laughs> just kidding. Let's see, what shall I do? Who's the country I log into? Wait, let's go to this one. Let's see what there are. There are but <laughs> these ones. Anything that I can buy, I kinda hard that. These ones. Only just five. Let's see. What's my favorite background? Let's try to get this one, Space Island. Anybody to get it? This. Nah, let's go to home. Challenges? Oh, yeah. Let's do challenges. Ooh, that's gonna be good. What is it gonna be? Challenges? Just come on quickly so I can just do my challenges now. I want my challenges now. Answer the question and please answer the question. Hmm? Seth Bucky bought 234 cases of strawberries. Last year of of loco from every case was 126. Strawberries strawberries. So the Bucky got a total of oh my what is it what is even this a total of wait less wait why is this happening oh my gosh I'm thinking it's like that. Try again. Oh my. Is there anything? Next. Oh my. What? Um, let's see what happens. What? Oh. Um, why is this? Okay. Okay, I'm just so confused. Should we go back home? What is even this challenge? Mm. Shopping? Nah. Oh, what's Grammar. It? What's Wordplay. <laughs> Wordplay. Grammar. Let's do actually typing. Typing fa typing um speed paragraph speed now that's way typing top Oh we're gonna show them how we're gonna show them. We'll show Type that F or J to begin. I just typed in boat. L A D got it. L A D Now what's next? Shall S H A L L Shall Add A D D Hag so let's say H A G G. Where's G G G? Hang. Flash. Okay, Fl you know Flash from the episode. Okay, let's type in Flash. Where is it? F. Wait. F. L. A. S. H. Flash. Flag. 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 Mm. 
flag. Hmm. I typed in G. Just capital I typed in. It's it's glass. S S. Half. Half. H A L F. Yeah. Once I put my hand on, it done. Wait, until this one. Okay, once I put my hand down, it just comes in. Mm -mm. Where is that letter? I'm just in the computer, just to let you know here. That's my keyboard. So I just type in L. It's all in this row. So we're just typing in this row only. So. So go. Well, I told you this one. Ah, uh, yep. You are a master. Yeah, I'm a master. Hooray! Who said I'm a master? D K. It's K in the row. Yep. S is in the row. L is in the row. Um, A is in the row. Um, G is in the row, H is in the row. Those letters? In this game, you will type capital letters. To capitalize a letter, use your pinkies to press and hold the shift key on the hand opposite the one typing the letter key. Type F or J to well, begin. Well, I'm on capital. I don't need to type in shift and stuff. <laughs> because look. Every time when the light comes, look. Do you even see the light? See that light? If the light comes, that means it's capital. K S L A G H G H F F G S F G <laughs> I just do like I went like <laughs> I don't need that was so easy. Oh my god I got the L correct <gasps> G correct Eight percent account <laughs> What? I thought I just press that. Now what shall what just happened? Um why did the sound go down? Let me just get some volume. Where are the volumes? Oh there it is. No, oh, not that. Has it came to you? Typing right. home row, typing top row, one. Maybe that's a little more, more, less. Typing top row, typing top row, one. Yeah. <laughs> that was so loud. Let's do that again. <laughs> We subtraction. Subtraction? We addition. Who wants to do addition? Well, I have other. Switch place? Do me the. Switch, look. I have like. Look, there's guest, my brother, and me. <laughs> you don't see my brother's islands? Switch player. KKK. Counting, sorting, and classifying. Switch. Let's turn to myself. Hmm, where shall I go? <gasps> I think I know, I think I know, 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 I know. No, just kidding, I don't. 
my my hand is my it just cracking. Oh. oh. Phonics, informational text, <laughs> capitalization and punctuation. Okay. We're just Capital gonna stay here forever. And the do not on. Ready for the do not on again, so you can understand clearly. Okay. When one word is joined with another, they team up to become a contraction. This is Action Contraction. Let us let's do not don't. That is that we are we're. Action contraction. Action contraction. Cool. Ow. I just did that song, but it's another one. We're gonna... The night is dark and full of errors. Help Floyd Floyd's Snow complete his wall before the sun sets. Use the proper nouns below to complete the sentence. I would like a cup of Lipton tea. Lipton tea. I would like a cup of Lipton tea. I love to eat and milk. I love to eat Oreo cookie meal and milk. Oreo cookies and milk. Oreo cookies. I love to eat Oreo cookies and milk. What? It's capital. Oreo cookies. Oh, I, I love know. to eat Oreo cookies and milk. I, I I'm so excited that it is almost time for... Kwanzaa. Kwanzaa. I'm so excited that it is almost time for Kwanzaa. Jennifer and went to the park. Oh, I James. know. Because Jennifer every name and has to James have a cat to go. Went to the park. <laughs> Floyd Snow can sleep Excuse well me, tonight. Dad. Keep practicing. You you're almost, almost have got it. it. You almost have it. I mean. I don't know I've done this before. Let's play ball. Apostrophes are used in contractions to combine two different words into one. Use the baseball mitt to catch the apostrophe in the correct spot. Cannot. Can't. That's right. Where is? Where's? That's right. Yes. Is not. Isn't. Uh. Remember, an apostrophe is used to replace the letters that have been dropped when two words are combined oh, into yes, a contraction. Sir. Is not. Isn't. That's right. Who is. Whose. That's right. Here is. Here's. That's right. Don't give up. You'll get it. Try again to make more contractions. You're, You're getting, getting that. Line on. What's this? I know it's on this. Is this a story? The Arnold was a plump turkey who'd lived in California all his life and dreamed of traveling to see the rest of the country's many wonders. He woke up one crisp November morning Bye. to a very important letter. Dear Mr. Turkey, I'd like to invite you to be the guest of honor at our special Thanksgiving dinner. Please come well-dressed. Sincerely, the President of the United States. Arnold jumped up and started packing his bag. 
He canceled all of his plans and set off immediately. You haven't eaten your breakfast, Arnold's granny called after him. There's no time to waste, Gran, he said, hustling out the door. I've got a very important appointment. Don't wait up for me. Arnold went straight to the train station. I must get to the president's house before next Thursday, he said to the ticket agent. I'm going to be the guest of honor at the Thanksgiving dinner. Oh, dear, the ticket agent said, clucking her tongue. She handed Arnold the ticket just in time, and he hopped on a train that went past the beautiful Grand Canyon and then round and round the Rocky Mountain. Soon, the mountain's snowy peaks passed, and the land turned into broad, green fields. Arnold gobbled with excitement. The old lady sitting next to him peered at him through her glasses. I'm going to spend Thanksgiving with the president, Arnold told her proudly. The lady's eyebrows raised up all the way into her pink hat in surprise. Aren't you worried about what they'll be eating for Thanksgiving at the president's? Of course not. I'm sure that whatever they serve oh. will be delicious. It's the president's A dinner, chat. after all, Arnold said, waving his wing. Well, I'm on the way to New York to stay with my children for Hanukkah. But do tell the president I say hello, the lady said. A chat. Ramold, um, they, again, they will Did you take a bath? Who didn't take bot? <coughs> they wish you play poppy popular. Oh, oh my gosh. Bad rule it. Two cards. Where is Mama's account? Mm, I don't know. It took longer to get to Washington, D.C. than Arnold thought it would but he couldn't help but cheer when he stepped off the train. He was in a whole new world, where busy people's neckties flapped behind them as they rushed for the subway, and grand historical buildings sat on every corner. I can't believe it, he sighed. I'm finally here. He was swept away by the sights and sounds of the nation's capital. He couldn't even count on his feathers how many museums and monuments he saw from the Lincoln Memorial all the way to the Smithsonian. Arnold noticed the time with a gasp. He fluttered up and down the street trying to hail a taxi, but none stopped. At this rate, I won't get a taxi until Christmas, he said with a huff, but Arnold was determined. He took three steps back, got a running start, and flew right into a taxi's open window. The president's house, on the double, Arnold squawked. The driver was so shocked, he couldn't think of anything to do but drive to the White House. Arnold rushed up to the biggest house he'd ever seen and pushed through the crowd. The president was already giving a speech. A man in a suit spotted Arnold, plucked him off the ground, and set him on a table. When Arnold looked around at all the guests' hungry faces, he started to get a little nervous. He tried to remember just exactly what it was that people liked to eat for Thanksgiving. Just then, the president walked over. Arnold's eyes grew wide and he held his breath. Hello, Arnold. I was worried you weren't going to make it, the president said. As president of the United States, I hereby pardon you from the Thanksgiving dinner table. Everyone clapped for Arnold, and he let out a big sigh of relief as he shook the president's hand. Arnold went to all of his new favorite spots in Washington, D.C. again, before getting on the train back home. Then, how's the story? Good? That was good. Who did Arnold Ronald? Arnold, ticket agent, his grandma. What special place did Arnold pass as he rode the train? Um. The Statue oh, of Liberty. That's what? okay.
We learn from mistakes. The White House. Try again. The Lincoln Memorial. The Grand Canyon. The Grand Canyon. Why did Arnold get nervous when the president put him on the dinner table? He was worried to have a chair sitting. Maybe this one. The guests looked hungry, and he was worried they would want to eat him. Which monument in Washington, D.C. did Arnold see in the taxi? The Grand, the Grand Canyon. Canyon. The Statue that's okay. of Liberty. No, that's Rushmore. okay. The we Lincoln learn from mistakes. Try again. Yay, <laughs> Your brain is just warming up. Try again. Yes, but... Yes, that's 50. No, I lost... Don't read on. Oh my! You shouldn't read it. The the Watchman Goby and the Pistol Shrimp are small animals that live in the ocean's coral reefs. The Goby and the Shrimp are quite different from one another. For instance, the Shrimp has five pairs of swimming legs and five pairs of walking legs, but the Goby has eight fins and no legs at all. The pistol shrimp gets its name because it has one big snapping claw that shoots out a burst of bubbles to stun predators. Pistol shrimp only grow to two inches long, but they are one of the loudest animals in the ocean. The shrimp is excellent at digging burrows and never seems to run out of energy. However, the shrimp also has bad eyesight and is nearly blind, so it's dangerous for the shrimp to leave its burrow home. The goby, on the other hand, can see just fine, and happens to like living in burrows as much as the pistol shrimp does. So, the shrimp and the watchman goby make a deal. The goby becomes the shrimp's eyes and protection, and the goby gets to live in the burrow with a very peppy housekeeper. The two animals work together every day to survive. The shrimp is always building and rebuilding the burrow so that it won't fill up with sand. When the shrimp goes out to eat or tidy up, the goby comes along to watch out for predators. As the shrimp gathers food, it stays close enough to the goby that its antenna is always touching the goby's tail. When the goby sees danger, it shivers its tail and both of them retreat back into the burrow. And if the shrimp wanders off and gets lost, the goby will go out and guide the shrimp all the way back to their home. Oh. Pistol shrimp and goby fish cooperate because together they can have a better and longer life. This kind of relationship is called symbiosis. But they aren't the only animals that show symbiosis. In South America, a bird called a cattle tyrant's favorite thing to eat are insects that pester the capybara. The cattle tyrant gets a snack and a ride on the capybara's back, and the capybara has someone around to keep away the pests. Anyone standing? Langer monkeys and spotted deer also help each other in nature. The monkeys go from treetop to treetop eating the leaves and allowing some to drop to the ground. The spotted deer follow the monkeys and eat the leaves they've dropped. Oh. Spotted deer can see, smell, and hear better than their monkey partners. When the langer monkeys forage on the ground and the deer sense danger, the deer stamp the ground with their hooves so that the monkeys can climb back to safety. Mm. Oh, there go. Nature has created some great partnerships. These symbiotic creatures know how to stick together. Shark moons, um, clownfish and fish emons, um, bees and flowers. Buffaloes and oxes, um, humans and dogs. The end. What did you learn? Nice. Learn anything good? I hope you did. Ready, readers? Let's answer questions about the story you just read. What home does the shrimp help to build for itself and the goby? Um, Sandcastle. No, I think it's a barrow. Yep. 
What part of the shrimp's body does it use to help it stay close to the goby? Um. Fin, fin. Fin, claw. Oh. Hotel. Uh, what's this then? How many fins does the goby have? Eight. Eight. <laughs> Don't turn this into an Who is the loudest animal in the ocean? Ooh. Shark. Clownfish. Clown pistol shrimp. Pistol shrimp. Dead pistol shrimp. How many pairs of walking legs and swimming legs does the pistol shrimp have? Five, six, six, eight, five. Oh, I'm going to eight or six. Your, your, your brain, brain is just warming, warming up. up. Try again. Yeah. Now, here comes the ultimate story of queer. That's getting that sounds. Ready, readers? Let's answer questions about the story you just read. What does the word stun mean? Stun. Stun. To protect, to shock. What does the word symbiosis mean? Symbiosis? What's symbiosis? Friendship. 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 No. Working That's together. Okay. We learn from mistakes. Try again. An animal what does that the likes word predator mean? Predator. An animal like to dig. An animal that eats other animals. Yep. What does the word forage mean? Forage? Search for food? Is that right? You're, You're getting, getting that. Learn, Learn on. on. I'm just getting there. Um. Many sources of information, such as newspapers, use text features to highlight important information. Find the text feature that shows the name of the article. Um... Wait, what? Wait, do we just press this? Find um. the text feature that shows slanted text for emphasis. Find the subheadline. Subheadline? What's a subheadline? Oh. Find the text feature that describes the photographs. Um. This one moved? Stuff. Trying to find the clues. In the. Nope. What describes it? The Brainsy Mountain. I think that's it. Maybe this is it? Okay, I don't know what this is for. Are you sure you want to leave this challenge? <laughs> Ostriches are the largest living birds. What are the two things they have that are larger than every other bird? Eyes and legs. Teeth, eyes and eggs. Teeth and feather. Ears and leg. Nests and tail. Ears, ears and le nests and tails. What is a group of penguins? How many toes do ostriches have on each foot? Each foot? Two. Two. How many feet wide can an ostrich's wingspan be? Two feet. Six feet. <laughs> Keep You're practicing. You almost, almost have, have it. it. Are you sure you want to leave this challenge? Why does it always Grandma. say that? 
Okay, let's go to home. <gasps> Challenge is open. Oh, uh, please be this one. I don't like. Uh, is this different? Be different. Please be different. There's nothing not different. Oh my gosh. Do I want to do this? Need an answer. Um, this one? Not quite. Next. I must get one right. Try again. Oh my god, this is so good challenging. I'm just gonna leave. I'm leaving. Hey, what challenge? Mm. And then how did I get that? Let's do this one and see if we don't know. Place value geometry. What's this? Oh. Time. Place value. Um. Subtraction. Sorry. Um. Oops, that just happened to accident. I think that happened to accident. Just happened by accident. Geometry. Time. And there's one little break for a quick second. We'll be right back. We have started, okay? Hope everybody's back. Is everyone back? I hope everyone is, because I'm gonna get ready. Just one sec, just kidding. What shall I do? I'm gonna go to paint. Hmm, lighting paint. Ooh, that was a V Kids play. Now, what shall I do now? Don't see all our paints. Wow, how do you like this one? I'm gonna, I'm gonna draw this one. Wait, where's our background? Oh, there it is. <laughs> this one looks way better. I want to get backgrounds. This one? Thank you. No, I not did. Okay, let's do blank. You can make your own back the background. And you know what I'm going to call it from now on? Virtual backgrounds. I'm going to call it these virtual backgrounds now. When I say virtual backgrounds, it means backgrounds. Okay?
Huh, you do like it. Now, let's go to stickers. Only that much stickers? Do I really need to buy all of them? Running shoes. Do I need to get that? Where is that tennis? 300! More stuff. What? Tools I have two. I have two. Like those ones are for free. What shall I do for today? Maybe let's do typing. Hmm. Typing bottom. Typing top. Typing top row. Typing top row two. What? Mm -mm -mm. Are you you now? Typing top. Typing top. Now I gotta get it all right. Ha -ha. In this case, ha -ha. you will type capital letters. To capitalize a letter, use your pinkies to press and hold the shift key on the hand opposite the one typing the letter key. Type F or J to begin. Didn't you want to type in J? DKS. Let's type in DKS. DKS. Um, and then, la, look at L A G H, L A G H, F J S. Got it. F J S. So F J. No. S L A K. G H. That was not hard, girl. K D L L A. K D L L A. Oh, I think I pressed. I think I pressed dead. Ready for all of them to be wrong? Told you. This has J H H J J J J K K I got them all correct and I didn't get all of this correct, mostly in all of it. Oh my gosh, I didn't press anything. D G you only see my keyboard. Mm. Why? Take a chip. Capital. Now. Okay. G H H. You're getting there. Learn Went on. on. I'm like, I don't. Do you like squirrels? Do you like squirrels or the train stuff? I like the train stuff. Type R or U to begin. I want to show a keep. R R U U R R U U U. That's one time higher. U U R. Oh, I just put that. R. We are only using two P cats and R U R U U. U R R R R U U One Two Three One Two Now Home Watch Oh U U 
are look look it's out there the keypad and then here it comes what oh i get it why i'm on, on capital letters r r u r r let's hide that keypad now so first we type in r then we type in r u r r Wait, you wall. That was so fast, that was like, I was like so scared when I did that. Keep practicing, you almost have it. It's like, oh my gosh! Oh, like that. I E. Type E or I to begin. Okay. Oh my gosh, I pressed D accidentally. That was weird. Yay, 88, 88, 88, 88. I kept those both wrong. Rules. Hundred. You are a master. You are a master. Hello. Bye bye. Okay. Hey guys, I hope you like this video and subscribe and okay, the game is finished. That's what I talked. So, the game is finished and I hope you like this video and subscribe for every videos. Subscribe for every videos that I say. Okay? Every video, even my old videos. Okay? Bye guys. Um joke. Um what joke shall I do? Let me just look at my joke book and see what joke shall I do choose. See? Where is my joke book? It has to be here somewhere. Oh there it is. Deli Joker. <laughs> That's what it says. So well, let's see. What's the date? June 28th. Sunday. Got it. June 28th. Where's June 28th? July. May. Um, let's find it. June. It must be 28th somewhere. June 28th. June 28th. Got it. Now, here's a joke. Did you hear about the new computer game based on the chatters? Any? It is. It's called Minecraft. It's called Minecraft. Okay, I hope you like this video and subscribe and like. Bye. And always buy a joke book so you can tell, add videos and upload them or do live and then tell jokes and in your videos. Bye guys!